Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, we're going to show you a quick tutorial on how to use Buffer. If you don't know, Buffer is essentially a social media distribution platform where you can organize your content and publish it on multiple social channels out there. So over here, you're going to see the pricing packages that are available and you can also click over here and select the number of channels for which you want to use this platform and based on that, the pricing will be reflected on this section. Uh, you can also select your yearly cycle or monthly cycle based on your needs. But for today's video, we're going to use their free plan to get started. We're going to set up our account by entering our email address and creating a password. So next, you're going to come to the screen where you're going to connect to your social media platform. So for this tutorial, we are going to connect to our LinkedIn page. So I'll select that and I'm going to click take me to LinkedIn. And over here, you're going to log into your account. And next, you're going to come to the screen where you can select the channels you would like to add. So for the purpose of this video, we're going to click our Woo Video LinkedIn page and we'll click Start Connecting. And next, you're going to receive a pop-up like that saying that you have successfully connected your channel. And I'm going to close this tab over here. So just to get some context, you can click this icon over here and make adjustments to your account setting. So things like your email address, your password, your billing, if you want to change your plan, the channels that you have connected, you can see them over here. And if you would like to connect to more channels, you can click connect channels and then you can access different social media platforms that you would want to add to the buffer platform. We're going to go back to the home screen and on top sections, you're going to see different tabs. So we're going to go to the create tab over here. So this is a space where you can plan your content. So you can brainstorm new ideas, plan accordingly and just have a nice space or like a gallery to organize everything so for instance under my to-do list i can click new idea so over here i just wrote my idea that hey we are thinking about creating content focused on health benefits of eating ginger or something like that you can also add an image over here if you want to keep a record of it or you can use their ai assistant tool just to get more help in terms of drafting those ideas so i'll click save idea over here so this will be under my to-do list and that way I can keep track of it. And once I am executing those ideas, I can just take in and put it under the in progress section. And once we have drafted that content and scheduled it, we can put this under the done section. And we also have new group icon over here, which is where you can add new uh, layers that you would like to have when planning your content out there. Next, we're going to go under the publish tool, which is where you can publish your content. So essentially, this is the calendar view. We can switch it from a weekly view into a monthly view. So I'm going to go for weekly view right now and I'll click new post. And over here, you can write your caption copy. And this is where you are going to see the channel that you have selected. So for now, it is LinkedIn in our case. So over here, I wrote my caption, uh, which talks about the benefits of eating ginger. And then I'm going to drop in my image or the video on this section. And you can add your image over here. And then you have the option to either save this post as a draft or you can schedule a draft or you can share it right now. If you click it, share it right now, it's going to be published on your account. I'm going to click save as a draft for now. And if you are ready to schedule it or if you want to schedule it, you can click over here, select the date and time and click done and just schedule the content. And once that is done, it's gonna be reflected on this calendar section over here. You have the analyze tool over here, which is where you can get uh, reporting data in terms of how your content is performing. So the number of audience you have, the impressions, engagement, um, and you can also filter it based on channels. So for instance, I can go to the LinkedIn page and I can see the followers I have, the average performance and stuff like that. And yeah, that's how you use Buffer. This was a very one-on-one -on -one basic tutorial, but it should be good enough for you to get started. Um, let me know if you have any questions or if you would like to see a more in-depth tutorial. But other than that, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, everybody.